Hi, so you've been wanting to make some whiteboard animations and it's a little bit hard to know where to start because there are a lot of options out there. So in this video, um, we're going to look into what the different options are. So depending on what your situation is, you can work out what's going to be the best option for you. So by the end of this, uh, you should know where you, where you need to go. Um, but there's a lot to investigate. Do your own research, obviously, but this is just going to help you get on your way. Uh, really, you've only got two options. You're going to be looking at spending some money to get someone to do the video for you, uh, save yourself some time, or uh, the second option is you do it yourself. And that's where people start to um, get lost in options, really. And it's, it's easy to do. You think you're saving all this money, but you can spend hours uh, hunting around and still not end up with anything better than what someone else would make. Um, but there is some good options. And again, coming down to what you want to do, if you're only planning probably one video for whatever reason, um, it can be better just to get someone else to do it. I've had um, people from Fiverr make some videos for me. I'll have the links in the description below so you can have a look. And there was mixed results. The first one I had made, um, I won't say I was all that impressed. I had to get some adjustments made. But for $35, I wasn't going to be too fussy. I just wanted to move on, get the video up and going. Uh, the next two, though, were really good. had no problem with the um, animator doing those ones. She snapped them out really quickly, um, it, just how I wanted them. So in that case, it was good. But it, yeah, $35 a pop, I ended up spending just over $100 for three videos, which compared to quite a while ago, um, that is dirt cheap. Um, and I mean, instead of um, buying software, which I may never have used again, um, I haven't done a whiteboard video since, so... Um, that might have saved me money anyway. It saved me a lot of time. I, I am a graphic designer by trade, uh, so it's a little bit against my nature to get someone else to do my work for me, but I kind of wanted to get these done quickly, so I hired someone else, um, considering I expect people to hire me. It's, uh, <laughs> it's only part of the game, um, but I think for the next ones, I, I would be looking at uh, buying the software and doing it myself, um, just because I think if I was going to make more than um, two or three of them, the cost of the software I'd end up saving. Um, I'd get, you're always going to be slow making your first one, but after that, when you get quicker, you know what you're doing. Uh, for me, I learn these things fairly quickly, so it's not so bad. But if it's, that's the other thing. If you've never really done like much creative work, like making videos, posters, images, anything like that, just making something and getting proportions right, placements right, timing, um, all these things, it can be difficult. Um, and so you, it's something, maybe it is better for the first one or two to get someone else to do it for you. So we'll pop over to the, um, the browser and I'll show you a few options and uh, what we can do. Okay, so we've come to Fiverr here for freelancing um, proposals. So it's a great place to find designers, uh, writers, animators, actors, musicians, uh, anything you need to hire out basically, though you're likely to find them in here. There are other websites and things you can go to to, to find freelance workers, but now Fiverr is probably one of the biggest and it's the only one I've used, so I can't really talk about the other ones, unfortunately. And so I'll show you through here, uh, up here in the middle, video and animation. And the first one on the list, whiteboard and animated explainers. Uh, so it's obviously the big thing at the moment with the video, uh, especially it's so easy to do and people love it. It's so catchy. Um, oh, I do. I get, get sucked into watching them all the time. Half the time, not even listening to what they're saying, just watching the, the scribbles. Um, you've got the options here, 2D animation, whiteboard, kinetic typography. You don't even know. Um, we'll have a look at whiteboard, see what that comes up with. And it's going to ask, do you need a script written? No, I already have it. Or you can ask them to edit the script. I would recommend writing your own script. Don't really hand that over to someone else unless you really need them to. Um, it's just handing too much control over. It depends what you're getting made and it depends uh, what your level of English or anything like that is. And do you need a voiceover? Yeah, most of the time you will unless you're... Um, hiring an actor to do one, they'll just do one using um, like a voice to speech thing. So it sounds a little robotic, but they usually let you choose between uh, an, 
a male or a female, typically an American male or American female. But you'd normally get asked that when your uh, order's being processed. And do you need music? No, nah, not really. But you might. Depends what you're making. So now they're going to give us a whole list of people that meet the criteria. And there's a huge range. I mean, look at this. $177, $73, $518. Uh, so you sort of got to scroll through and see what you're going to get for your money. Wow, nearly just over three and a half thousand dollars. Mind you, he's only had three orders, so it's not not great, is it? It's one of the best, over a thousand orders at fifty dollars, forty dollars. You can spend a bit of time scrolling through trying to find out most of them seem to be around the 50 to 60 dollar mark so we'll just pick one oh 22 dollars let's see what she does she's only had 20 orders not a lot of experience but we'll just see what she's offering and bear in mind a lot of these guys are using the same software they might already have all the same templates it's just a case of who's offering to use it at what price so to tell you here, the basic standard and premium. So $15 gets you a logo, background music, only 30 seconds. That is not long. That's not going to be long enough if you're going to go for YouTube. So what's she offering for the standard two-day delivery? Oh, you get up to 60 seconds. And that's $44 premium. $73, 90 seconds running time. Yeah, you're not getting long videos with that one. Um, Typically, I'd be looking around 30, 300 words, especially for YouTube, and it should end up about four or five minutes. So quite often, I could spend forever scrolling through trying to find someone for what I'm looking to meet the bill for what I'm looking for. Um, but it, sometimes it's easier just to go to the home page, post a request. And this means you're going to put a request into Fiverr for all these people to approach you to say yeah we want the work and this is what we'll offer this is what we'll do it for so we'll just have a quick look through what you need to do first before we put that in there because you can choose half of it gets done before you type it in oh it's jumping around a bit so we want video and animation whiteboard uh, we want it in three days the budget Oh, you can put whatever you like in there. Uh, so we want to say 300 word script provided. Need mail voiceover. Uh, whatever you want to put in there, whatever you need and post it and it usually takes about 24 hours and you probably get a good 20 to 30 people approach you with an offer um, and out of one of those there'll be one that can help and especially if you're in a hurry um, you might not have time to do this way but um, if you've got a couple of days then at least you're going to get someone approaching you uh, that you're going to be able to use which is the ideal way um, now if you're looking at going and making things yourself now that you've seen how much these guys can make doing these things. Um, I would say Animaker is probably the best of the free options. Uh, purely because with any of the free options, they're all on limited features of some sort. Uh, some of them will put a white, um, a little logo in the corner, a watermark, sorry, um, so that you know who made, what program you use to make it. Some of them will only let you use certain functions. Some of them limit the time and Animaker does limit the time of the video that you can produce so it's limited to two minutes some of them are 30 seconds a minute and so two minutes is not too bad but at least you're getting to use everything and uh, you can make some pretty slick little videos the other thing is some of them are just free trials so the likes of Powtoon and Explandio um, you can get a free trial but it's only for two weeks 30 days something like that which is Possibly enough for you to make one or two videos and leave it at that anyway. You might be happy with that. Uh, so you do get the options of different types of animations in here. So easy a little kid on a laptop can do it. Shockingly easy to use. Uh, so here, here they're showing it's just a case of drag and drop. 
get your little characters and any clip art and whatnot and you just drop it into the thing and on the timeline and it's going to make a little animation for you so yeah really easy most people have it now i'm not sure what their pricing is we'll have a look um so animate now it's free are they going to show us okay so 12 dollars a month that's pretty reasonable uh 19 dollars a month uh, just as a startup, so the business one, thirty-nine dollars per month. So that's still pretty good, and it just shows you what you get. So the video length, five minutes, fifteen minutes, thirty minutes. So you can make some really good videos with that one. Uh, now it does limit the number of monthly exports as well. So if you're planning on making a lot, if you're going to go on Fiverr and be one of those people, you probably want that one. 59 build monthly, so I'm not sure. Oh, if you're going annually, it'll work out to be cheaper, $39. But if you're going to just pay it monthly, then $59. Um, still worth it, I guess, if you're going to do that sort of amount. Uh, but for my money, this guy here, Animation Studio. Um, now, partly because they do, I mean, you can do pretty much anything with it, but also they tend, if you're looking at selling with these videos, using them as little sales videos, these guys seem to have a, a better setup for it. Now, they also, at the moment, this deal, so I've actually got this, and I probably aren't even going to use it, just purely because instead of paying that amount per month, which, as I mentioned, is worth it, um, 47 bucks, one time, lifetime, you've got it. That's about the same as what we were paying with Fiverr. Um, a little bit more than what I paid, so I got some for thirty-five dollars each. But those other ones we looked at around fifty dollars. That's you've got it. So anytime I need to make one from now on, I'm just going to jump into here and pop one out. Uh, super simple. That's a steal, um, especially yeah, looking at Animaker what they're charging per month. That adds up over a year, especially if you're only using it occasionally. This is hands down the best video animation online software anyway, but it's um, at that price by far the best deal. Best bang for your buck anyway, but that's some options for you. It's up to you. You can make your own mind up and do your own research. That's just um, what I've found, what I've been using. So there we go, guys, making it nice and easy for you. There are a lot of options you can look around for, but those are my picks and um, reasons why I would go for each of those options. So again, depending on what your um, situation is, what's going to suit you best. And I've put some links down in the description as well if you just want to go to those, go straight to them. Uh, now I can't promise the special will be on for the Animator Studio, but um, hopefully it is, and if it is, grab it. Okay, now if you've got any questions, please leave them in the uh, comment below. Love to hear from people. Um, and all the best.